we have made it in the access in the mobility vehicle to the top we're next to St Margaret's Chapel which is the oldest building in Edinburgh from the 1100s was it 1130 1170 something like that look how high we are really really high it gets super high up up here there's Waverley station and then oh, well along from that tracks and there's the cemetery for soldiers dogs this was used by the army for a while after it stopped being a royal palace wow you can see a lot of Edinburgh from up here it's giving me the GB's though it's a bit high Stadium over there, Murrayfield. There's the chapel. And they brought out the big guns just for us. Didn't they? What's that, sorry? Brought out the big guns. Yeah, definitely brought out the big guns. Gonna check out King David's Tower now. Let's have a look down here. Ooh, what's in here? It's very dark. Over 100 soldiers, one slept in these. These are freezing cold. Freezing cold. Let's have a look up here. Ooh. King David's Tower is like dark and damp. But soldiers slept in there. It's dark and damp and soldier subject, and now it's a toilet. Yeah. <laughs> so it's still dark and damp. Yeah. <laughs> We're in the castle square. And there's lots of impressive buildings here. You've got the War Memorial, the Scottish War Memorial, which looks pretty impressive. You've got the Queen Anne building. We'll have a look in the ones we can. And you've got the Great Hall. And then the Royal Palace, where the Crown Jewels are. Do you want to see the Crown Jewels? Yes, that would be good. Checking out the Great Hall, which was built for King James the Fourth. Looks like pretty much every other Great Hall we're going. <laughs> it does. <laughs> Looks very similar to the one at um, Bambra. Bambra. radiators? I don't think they did, I think they've just been put in after. Oh. <laughs> so we've just found out I can actually go in and see the crown jewels but it's only allowed one wheelchair user in at a time so we've got to wait for the other wheelchair user to come down so then we can use the lift to go up. We can't film or photograph the crown jewels so that's as close as you get. That's a replica. <laughs> mm. It's very red. Um, not as impressive as the ones in London. But I guess they don't have a monarchy here for a while. Yeah, true. Well, there's a look, there's your eagle. Do 
Shall we check out the war memorial? Here's the garden. Do not walk in it. <laughs> but we're going to head in there and check that out. We're in the Queen Auntie room and I've got before vlogged. Mm. You know I like a scone, but I've got to be careful how I eat them. Mm. Quite a cream, really good. I don't think you love a scone more than Kara. No. I agree with that statement. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Do you like a scone, Tori? Yes. Yes. My mouth is watering. <laughs> I've went for Eggs Benedict, but when I saw Caroline's scone and everyone else's, I've added one of them as well, but I've got Eggs Benedict. Let's give it, yeah, let's give it a try. It's got green stuff on it though. Once you're back home, you're back to normal. That looks as though it's going to be a perfect egg. Oh, look at that. That is, that is good That's egg. perfect. Good egg. I've got a coffee for you, my friend. Where are you? Oh, Where are you? that's really nice. Yeah, that's you enjoy it. The eggs Benedict was quite nice, tangy, but I had to get a scone, um, and it was very soft and flaky and delicious. We're going to check out more of the castle. Sean, do you want some whiskey? I don't want any whiskey. Does it's Anne you who wants whiskey? Me wants whiskey. Oh, I only have whiskey, but it's a hot toddy. Ant wants whiskey. Say yes, Ant. That's right. Yes. That's a pretty cool whiskey map. It is. Swanty. Yeah. Cheers. Let's, look, let's check out some whiskies. It's only a little shop. Yeah. Should we get some whiskies? Oh, they're tiny little whiskies. <laughs> a double class whiskey. Loads. What's that one up there? Edinburgh Castle whiskey. Look at that one. What's that in the shape of? A shaved castle shaped bottle. That's pretty cool. Castle shaped bottle of whiskey. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna buy Ant and Jeremy because they both like whiskey. Uh, a bottle of whiskey each. Oh, yeah, they had it in the hotel. Oh, look at that funky one up there. This one. Do you want to try some whiskey? Uh, um, uh, maybe. <laughs> so this is a Scottish That's version nice. of Bailey's. That's nice. Yum, yum, yum. Mm. It's actually really nice. It's really smooth. Sean, who's that guy? Who's that fellow over there? I have no idea. You don't want to mess with so this fella. The king is, is no. his army, he's the royal herald. So when the when king the sends messages to other kings, sends him. If you attack him, sure it's treason. Yeah. Arrived, I, I hope you enjoy your whiskey. Don't drink it all at once. I'll try not to. Yeah. <laughs> Portion it out. It's yeah. It's Tory size. Yeah. Let's check out the prisons. Caroline, you need to build. You belong down there. Oh, look at the hammocks yeah, down get there. Get in the prison. You belong down there. You do. <laughs> oh, it stinks in here. What's around there? Jeremy, she says it stinks in here. It's probably because I walked in. <laughs> this is old-fashioned graffiti. That's a heavy-duty prison door. That is. Is it? It's wood. Yeah, yeah. but it's still heavy-duty. That'll keep you in. Yeah, it's old-fashioned graffiti. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. That's another big door. The war at sea. Another door. Communal prisons. The hammocks would probably be quite comfortable, actually. Yeah, 
something of a calm down act of one of Jones himself. I heard he'd returned to America last year. But what since then? Last I heard, he's still there. Oh, more, more birds up here. I think the hammock would probably be more comfortable than the hard bed underneath. And the prisoners do dancing. Oh. This looks like a body, but it's not. It's just a rolled up hammock. Down from the highest up point. There's a gun happening in 10 minutes. Yeah. There's a gun happening in 10 minutes. There's a gun happening in 10 minutes. It's a one o'clock gun. Um, the views up here are amazing, but I will say it is an absolute nightmare for somebody who's in a wheelchair who's, who suffers from extreme pain. I'm in absolute agony and I don't think I could do it again, but it is absolutely stunning and the views are beautiful. From all the cobbles and the yeah, height. I'm really struggling. What do you think of the castle? It's pretty. Yeah. It's really high though. Yeah. Lots of hills. Yeah. You excited for the gun? Oh, that's gonna happen very soon. Yeah. Uh, Is it loud from here? It's a gun. Boom. It's not a pew. It's a... Boom. Probably a cannon, right? It's a boom. Which one is it? I guess it is quite nice. Oh, we should watch it. What do you think of the castle, Tori? <laughs> Wide-eyed with excitement. I come with disappointing news. The one o'clock gun will not be fired today at one o'clock. One oh five? No. Well, they're not firing it today. No. Oh uh, well. Good Friday. Is that because it's Good Friday? I don't know. Probably. Should we head? Things down? don't happen on a Good Friday. Not even post. Should we head down to the entrance? Tickets to come here. Oh, kitty. <laughs> what? 2195? I think so, I can look it up. 2195 we think. Um, if you're English, if you're an English Heritage member like Caroline is, uh, as long as you're in your renewal year or later, it's free. If you're in your renewal year, you get a reduced rate. Um, but 2195 for everybody else. Uh, we're gonna head that way along some more cobbles. There's some big guns up there. Down here too, man. Yeah, but you wouldn't want you wouldn't want to have a gun off with them though. No, definitely not. No. No, no. It wouldn't be fair to them. Yeah, we're heading down, and uh, all roads lead to the gift shop, as always. Fancy around the golf shore? Not particularly. <laughs> oh, I want this dog. Ah, oh, I love it. Oh, sure, I love it. Harris Tweed. Yes. Twenty-seven pound. It's yes, but it's Harris Tweed. Should we get? <gasps> should we get Sebastian one? Oh. Should we? I think so. Should we? I think so. Should we? Yes, I think Should we? So. Yes, I think so. They didn't have the court in Sebastian size, so we couldn't get one. But I have found a t-shirt with grey fires, Bobby. Oh. It's Scotty dog. It's grey fires, Bobby. Yes. Showing you a little bit quackers. You must be quackers if I think I'm buying that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, see, you're quite good. Oh, that's my birthstone. We couldn't get the coat for Sebastian because they didn't have a size. We did pick up a magnet. And this is the face first like watercolory artworky type magnet that we've picked up. There was a couple of nice ones in there. Yeah. We do like a nice magnet we do. from places we visit. That's and it was £3.50. Three pound 50. Not bad. Lots of nice stuff in there that I could have bought. Yeah, um, scarves and everything. Scarves. The cute. Sh there was a cute sheep scarf. Oh my goodness! But it was for children. <laughs> That's our day at Edinburgh Castle. All done. 
You can spend a good few hours here. There's lots to see. Things we didn't see because we took it very slowly. There's a tilly and cobbles and stuff. But lot, lots to see and do here. Yeah, what do you think? It's, it's one of those places you need, need to, to do at least once in your life. Yeah. Um, like I was saying before, it is not really wheelchair accessible. They've tried the hardest, but it is an old building, which is what you expect. They've done a good job. Yeah, and, it, and Edinburgh's hilly, and it's extremely hilly, and it's hard for Sean pushing and pulling mm. back, um, and it's really bad. If you've got backache and neckache and problems like that, and problems with headaches and stuff, and problems with pressure um, due to something like POTS, then I would say maybe try it once but you will probably suffer after and suffer in between so it's it's one of them things you either decide if you want to if it's something you want to do a lot or not yeah practice walking up lots of hills and stairs and, <laughs> and, you'll, and you'll be good for here yeah. and for edinburgh yeah um so that's our time at edinburgh castle keep making memories catch you later see you in the next one <laughs>